Welcome back to Leaders of Tomorrow. The pharmaceutical capital of the country, Hyderabad, has many innovative entrepreneurs. Our next story today is of a 26-year-old company that is achieving milestones in the field of peptide chemistry. Here's the story of Jupiter Bioscience. The foundation of Jupiter Bioscience was laid in 1985 as a small-scale bulk drug manufacturing unit. With imports becoming expensive due to the Gulf War in 1991 and increasing competition from the Chinese in the following years, Jupiter chose to excel in a niche field, that of peptide chemistry. 94 and 95 we did a lot of uh, market study and scientific study. And 95 we initiated the process innovation for the peptide chemistry. So essentially what we have as a company, the philosophy is process innovation, process development and process optimization and scale up, which is our expertise. Taking over his father's business, Venkat Kalvakolanu has put his science degree to good use. He started off with taking care of commercial operations and marketing of the brand, but eventually underwent training in research and development and pioneered the peptide business model of the company. In the peptide pharmaceuticals, uh, the competition does not exist in India. Uh, scantily, there is some people who are doing custom peptides kind of work. But the, predominantly, the competition is from Europe, US, Japan and Israel, primarily. And uh, in the entire value chain, there is competition in each of the value chain. So there is no single company which is focusing from the starting material to the finished product. Jupiter Bioscience has over the years launched a subsidiary with the name of Sven Genitech that caters to all its formulation needs. In addition, it has set up manufacturing facilities in Switzerland and in the United States that have increased the company's international client base. Today, the group is producing niche and path-breaking products using peptide chemistry for various disorders related to oncology, diabetes, dermatology, infertility, orthopedic problems and more. The peptides are part of uh, what you could call as part of your normal system. That's basically these are all amino acids which are part of your normal system. So when you're using a product which is a peptide, we, it mimics most of your natural actions. So the potential side effect profile is much lower. Most of our customers are uh, like uh, R&D institutions, uh, universities which are uh, doing more of a research orientation or critical care products, people manufacturing the critical care products. In 1995, Venkat and the management at Jupiter decided to take the company public. At a time when funding for research and development was hard to come by, the IPO route seemed the best option to raise capital. As a result, today the company has the who's who of the global pharmaceutical arena as its clients and has achieved an impressive turnover of 330 crore rupees. It took two years for us to take a decision uh, to get to the IPO stage. There was very, very little opportunities available for funding. And Consumers around the world are slowly opting for these to avoid side effects and chemical reactions of any kind. And making all this possible for Jupiter Bioscience is its team of highly qualified professionals conducting research and development. R&D strength or the, of Jupiter Bioscience happens to be very large. We spent almost 8 to 10 crores last year on R&D. See, basically our competition is to make things for markets like United States, Europe, Japan, and you need to compete with the highly developed world. Secondly, you have to make something which is sometimes much cheaper. To support this positive growth of small and medium enterprises like Jupiter Bioscience, the Andhra Pradesh government is doing all it can to provide an environment conducive to the pharma sector's growth. We have exclusive ACZ for pharma, pharmaceutical industry. Apart from that, we have industrial estate devoted to pharma units. In the cluster approach and in the industrial area approach, we provide the common facilities center, whether it is effluent uh, um, treatment or whatever, R&D, all these things we provide. 
With this proactive approach of the government, Hyderabad's pharmaceutical cluster is bound to grow tremendously in the coming years. And Jupiter Bioscience is one such promising enterprise that is satisfying its customers and living up to its tagline of creating stronger bonds.